Hey guys, it's Michelle. So I'm doing part two of items I've used up. There's not too many items left, but um, enough to warn another video. Anyway, the next thing I have to show you, and I'm upset that I ran out of this, and I've gone back looking for more, but they haven't had it. I got this at TJ Maxx for like $7.99. See? And I know I showed you the sea salt one, but this one is... Paradise Beach, Sand Dollar Island. This is the body scrub. And this is a salt base. Sea Minerals body scrub. I wish you could smell it. Oh my god. Definitely a nice fresh oceany scent, which I adore. I love how they have the Sand Dollar on the top. And this stuff works great. It was a real thick, creamy, almost like a sugar scrub, but it was salt based. Um, and it did such a great job. I love using this stuff. I love exfoliating. I know I shouldn't because of my eczema, but once a week I have to exfoliate. You gotta get the dead skin cells off. And I've noticed that by doing so, especially like with dead sea salt minerals, it has helped my eczema to a degree. Of course you have to lotion afterwards and stuff. But there's something in the dead sea salt and the minerals in there that seems to help with my eczema. And getting rid of those dead cells does um, help your skin. So I do a different scrub every week to get, um, you know, to do that. I know that St. Ives has a um, apricot scrub for the body that I want to try. I do use the face one on my body, but I would love to try the actual one for your body as well because I heard great things about it. But this one smells incredible. A little goes a long way. It feels amazing on and I got it for a steal. It, it says it's comparable to $14 and I paid $8 which, um, considering what I've paid for other scrubs, I didn't think that was too bad of a price for this one. Uh, if I found it at TJ Maxx, I would definitely buy it again. I would not spend $14 on it, though, but that was a good choice. This one, I gotta get online and get more. Uh, this was my Into the Wild. I did this on my items I, I'm loving at the moment. Uh, the grape fruitiness of this is just incredible. I love it, and the packaging is so cute. I wish that they still had it in the stores, because this one is very, very nice. But it is still online, and it is on sale, so I have to get my hands on some more before they completely do away with it. I kind of like the old bottles, too. The new bottles are prettier, but there's something nostalgic about these as well. I don't know why, but I do like it. But Into the Wild, I, a friend of mine got me hooked on this stuff. And I love it because of, to me, it smells grapefruity, and I don't think there's any grapefruit notes in it. The fragrance sprays don't have a description, but this was definitely um, my favorite. My dog doesn't like it, though. Every time I would put this on, she'd be like, hit you, hit you, hit you. like she doesn't like it, but I love it. Next. Oh, this was a sample from Bath & Body Works. Let me see. This was a sample of Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin Lotion. And again, I didn't get Joey any of the lotion because he doesn't. He'll use, um, I think he uses Jergens right now or Avena. He's got one of those two. But he's got the shower gel, but he won't use the Bath & Body Works lotions. So I had gotten this little sample during one of their things that they were doing. And I used it up. Very nice. But I have so many lotions, I didn't buy this one for myself. So I just had a little sample and I really did enjoy it. I can see why it's very, very popular. What else do I have here? Now this, I have to get some. Because I forgot how great this stuff smells and how great it works. Now, this is the Jergens original scent, which is the Cherry Almond Moisturizer. This is just the regular one. Uh, this was just a free sample card that I got in the mail. It was awesome. Let's see. I can get a little out. I mean, I really... Oh, there's some! Oh, it's just a really... Because I remember, like, having babysitters and stuff use this stuff. And the scent is just really, I want to say therapeutic and relaxing. It's a cherry almond scent. Really nice basic moisturizer. You can't go wrong with this. And I do have a coupon, so I definitely will be having to go and get some of this. I haven't yet because I have so many lotions that I'm using now. But definitely this is one I'll be using like when I get out of the bathtub. It's just, oh. I forgot how good this stuff smelt. But I did really enjoy using this little sample. I think I got this through the mail. I don't remember where I got that sample from. But I do enjoy it. 
Next, I used up another one of these um, Appeal Cucumber Cleaning Tissues. I really like these. I love how this doesn't smell like fake cucumber. I think there's actual cucumber in here. Cucumber extract, yes. Very fresh. Uh, they work very, very well. And I paid like $1.29 for this at the Christmas tree store. And they have different ones, but I've been using the cucumber melon one. And I normally, is this cucumber melon? No, just regular cucumber. And I normally don't like cucumber melon or cucumber in general, just because it's been overdone. But this one was very refreshing. I think I have one more package of these left. Hopefully the store will have them when I go back. Probably not because I love them now, but that's how it works for me. But definitely um, worth the money because there's 30 and I paid $1.29. Whereas the old ones that I was using, um, you got half of that for around the same price. So this was definitely worth it. I would definitely buy these again if I find them again. Next, and I really loved this stuff. And it lasted a really long time. Now, this is an organic company. This is Nuve Echo. And this was Volumizing Mascara. And this was a blue one. I know I talked about this and in items I'm loving at the moment. As you can see, it is very, very blue. But I really do love these odd colored mascaras because it's a pop of color. Like, especially if you're doing... I use this a lot with um, a black uh, eyeshadow. So this really makes it pop. And I love the applicator. Can you see that? Come on. Focus, please. I really love the applicator on this. It worked really, really well. Um, use this almost every day with almost every look. And it wasn't in your face blue. I mean, it is an electric blue. But it definitely showed off your eyelashes. But not necessarily like, whoa, your eyelashes are blue. It was just enough. I really did like this product. It went on really well. It came off really well. If I can find this um, line, I will definitely try this again. I don't even know where this line is carried. I've never seen it. I had gotten this um, in a swap, but I have never seen or heard of this line. Um, I do know that they are online. I've just recently ordered some stuff on there for um, a giveaway. But, yeah, really, really awesome. Really, really nice. And last but certainly not least, one of my favorite lotions, as you will know. This packaging is so old, guys. Half of you were probably too young to even remember it. This is my Juniper Breeze. Look at how old this bottle is. I remember when... Um, I remember when Bath & Body Works weren't as hip as they are now. When it actually looked more like a country... Like where you would go buy vegetables, like a country vegetable market with all the baskets and everything. And this is what they looked like. And I still kind of like the old packaging. Mm -mm -mm. This One of the scents that started it for me. This was one of the things that started the addiction. This and the original country apple. But yes, I remember when they used to look like this. And Bath & Works didn't always look as chic as it does now. And that's... I, I remember buying... I wasn't really that into it at the time, but they had a big sale, like the semi-annual sale, and I happened to co have caught it at the right time, and I bought a few of these, and Country Apple as well, from what I remember, and I hung on to it because I couldn't find the, they, they discontinued it in the store. I couldn't find it again, but then they had it at the last semi-annual sale, and I loaded up. It's just fresh and clean and delicious. I really love the scent of Juniper Breeze. Um, I, every time I go online to get the darn candle, it's always sold out, so it must be incredible, because I want the stupid candle of this stuff so badly, and eventually it will happen. But this is definitely one of my top favorites. It is oh, iconic as far as I'm concerned. Normally when I do a giveaway or something, somehow or another, somebody gets a Juniper Breeze thrown in there, because it's just, to me, just absolutely amazing. So that is that one. And Desi's here. Come here. Come here. Here's my Desi. Here's my Desi. Anyway, guys, so that's items I am loving at the moment. I am going to be filming a mini haul really quickly right after this. Um, just because I've been meaning to do it, but I haven't done it, so I will be looking the same in that video. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Like this video and comment down below on which items you've tried and have liked or items that maybe you think I would enjoy and I should try, maybe do a review on it. There's a few items that I will be um, 
doing videos on in the future just to let you guys know and if you haven't subscribed already do so as well i do a bunch of different things on this channel from beauty related to toys absolutely everything goes on this channel so i will see you all later guys take care love yous bye